What we've learned through many of these studies on happiness is life fundamentally has three dimensions the way we live it. Our career, our relationships, and our lifestyle. And to the extent that all those things are supported by each other, in other words, that the career I really want to have will produce the lifestyle I really want to live and foster the relationships that I most enjoy and treasure, life is great. It's called high life satisfaction. To the extent that the career I have takes me away from the relationships that I really enjoy and destroys any chance of living the lifestyle I really long to live right now, my life is nothing but stress. It's all about competing priorities. And when we hear this term life balance, it's all about how do I squeeze my life onto my Palm Pilot. In other words, the conventional thinking is, you know, if I'm better at scheduling my time, I can make time for all these things that are important. And you know what? Life does not show up on schedule. And in fact, living this life balance according to your Palm Pilot becomes another stressor. It's like, gee, if I can just get this perfect, I'll have success. But you never make it perfect because the most important things in life are always unexpected. A child's sickness, a championship game, a time where your spouse really needs to connect with you because they've had a major disappointment. All of those will come at the most inconvenient time for you. And if you aren't really clear that living a life that supports a career where you can really express your design, relationships that fill your soul, and a lifestyle that gives you passion for living, you will live a life of suffering.